The small island is amongst the most affluent in Asia, and protests such as this one are rare. But many Singaporeans braved the weather to vent their frustrations over a government proposal to increase the nation's population by as much as 30% in less than 20 years by bringing in foreign workers to offset the nation's low birth rate. According to organizers, some four to 5,000 people gathered at Speaker's Corner, a park the size of a football field that's specially designated for such gatherings in the strictly controlled state. I think by 2020, probably we have Singaporeans be the minority population ratio. Foreigners will be the majority population ratio here. I think Singaporeans are angry. Our basic survivor is at stake here. Already an influx of foreigners in the last decade has seen their numbers rise to 40% of the population. Foreigners have been blamed for the rising cost of living, crowding public transport and the growing gap between rich and poor. There hasn't been a recognition of kind of the social transformations that are taking place on the street. And many of those who come from outside don't really engage with the society. And there's always, there's, because these changes have happened so fast. The government's responded by providing funds for the elderly and low-income households. They've sped up construction of public housing and plan to improve transport infrastructure to help ease congestion in one of the most densely populated cities in the world. And they're urging their population to have more babies so they won't have to rely on foreigners to keep the economy growing. Sharon Jitlail, BBC News, Singapore.